Ladies and gentlemen, we are here. And we are ready for some PvP. Which we are going to get set up as soon as possible. Alright. Um, so with the new update, this is now in the um, round table hold. You might not realize what it does yet, and I will be showing you what it is. This accesses the arena PvP, which we have three Colosseums. The first one is in Limgrave, the second one is in Kalid, and the third one is all the way up in the capital. We're going to start off with the one you can get at the very beginning. And then we're going to show you more and more. Alright. So. I do not have torrent on my hotbar. So I'm a pleb. I do believe it's just up this way. Yep, just straight up this road from the side of grace war master shack and you can come here straight from the very beginning of the game and uh you don't have to do anything you don't even need torrent you can walk there this is uh my farthest character so i don't think i'll be able to get to into any matches but we will see we'll give it a shot but first, we're just going to open them up so you can see where they are. Kind of how they work. Alright. So once you access the Colosseum, America Statue is here. And you have, uh, wow. I didn't realize you'd be able to do all of them from here. You have Combat Ordeal, which is, uh... I believe that's a free-for-all, and then United Combat is if you want to do 2v2s or 3v3s, um, which there are options for. So yeah, this would be your 2v2, this would be your 3v3, and then you also, oh, not yet, from here, you would have more options for Spirit Summons at the other Coliseums. You can have passwords in so you can play with friends, or eventually, hopefully, we'll have group passwords for the communities. I'm waiting for someone to announce that so I can put it in. <laughs> um, you can choose what Coliseum you want to play at. I'm not sure if that will affect your loading times. Probably, depending. But I think the last one will have the, the biggest um, range for uh, options and people to play. And then you just enter combat and then you sit in this room and wait for PvP to start and everyone in the lobby. And after you discover it, it is now on the map. It's a real thing. Alright, so second one. We're going to go to the capital. Open that one up. So the first one is mainly for duels, but I guess there was also another update where they, you can, just from that one, just straight up go into 2v2s and 3v3s. Just no spirit ashes allowed. All right, and this second one, um, can we get up here? <laughs> I just did this two seconds ago. All right, and this looks fine. Okay, we're good. We're good. I'm gonna run, run, run over here. I haven't gone through this area exclusively because it's New Game Plus. There, I don't know. Um, but you don't have to do anything to get here except for run. If you want to, you can run straight here from the beginning of the game once you get torrent. Why does it tank a boy? Yes, it is. You also don't need to kill these guys, but. They're arena bastards, and there's an arena up here. Gladiators will fall and die. Many. Oh, another one. Can 
I get more damage out of this? I could have sworn I was doing more damage last time I played this. Do we? That's a little better. That probably is because of the sneak attack, though. That is still a lot better. <laughs> hey, got that sword ritual. Ritual sword talisman. Yeah, shield talisman. I am sorry. It's pretty early, and I am just super excited for this PvP. Ah, okay, there are people dying in here for some reason. I don't know. Alright, second one. This is the Royal Coliseum, and, uh, oh, this is the one where only duels. Okay, so the first one is more options. This one is just 2v2s with prohibited no spirit ashes. Same gist, um, this is just the Royal Coliseum, and then you wait, and then you can, uh, get duels in. It's probably where I'm gonna start first. Um, once I actually unlock all of them, you got the Royal Coliseum activated. Engrave, and then the next one, uh, this one's a little harder to get. For this one, yeah, you start the game here, you just go, do 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 arena. If you want to get to the other one, you can do, like, this route, go all the way up, and then get the, either, um, the Dectus Medallion to get into the capital or you can just scooby doop up this little side thingy and then get through the capital all sneaky like and then zippity zoop up there for the last one in Kalid, which is the most chaotic uh, you can still access that from Limgrave, uh, Limgrave technically you just need the seal for river well you go down into this all the way around here you'll need some stone sword keys too to activate this lift then you come out and you're up here you go here there will be uh two giants actually i guess we'll just teleport here because we need to go and open it up this is so different having new content for elden ring and it's not even dlc they just give it to us they're just like here have this Play the game. We love you. And if you guys didn't hear, Elden Ring won Game of the Year. The only competition I think would have been God of War, and I love God of War. Been playing it since the first one, and it cannot even hold a candle to this. So I don't know why people were not exactly worried, but like thinking that it was on the same level. These guys are not that hard. Can I get in there? No, I can't. Okay. Um, from what I've discovered, just a few charged R2 attacks to the ankles, depending on what weapon you have, what setup, should uh, bring them down. You just gotta watch out for those nasty arrows. I have a shit ton of health. This character is, a, I'd say, over-leveled. For uh, New Game Plus, because I did a bunch of grinding at the grinding spot. If you know, you know. So, four charged attacks was bringing him then down with just a greatsword. Well, not just a greatsword. This is the uh, my favorite greatsword. Favorite for uh, usage, not exactly it's pretty. <laughs> it's kind of weird looking, but it's so damn useful, you cannot argue with it. The lifesteal ability is cracked. There's the big pot, you can, or jar. You can do some battles up there and get a big jar talisman for more equip load if that is something you need to do at this point. I've already got mine from new game, or from first game. All right, and here's the last Colosseum. Every single one of the Colosseums seems to have this door on the right, which I want to open. Doesn't look openable, like you could just walk into the arena if you wanted to. Um, but here we have duels, combat ordeal, which is PvP, or free-for-all. 
and then United Combat, which is your uh, teams. Then you have your 1v1, 2v2, 3v3, and then Spirit... Oh! Spirit Ashes seem to be only allowed here. There's only Spirit Ashes. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Then you have your uh, password again. Restrictions. Um, desired team. Desired team. I don't know what these are for. Hopefully we get another update with more information on these things. Because this seems hardly full from complete at this point. And then you would wait. And then you would uh, just wait in here and wait for PvP to happen. So you got your Kalid. Your Limgrave. And your Royal Coliseum. Those, so those are the three so far. Um... I say so far, like, I know there's going to be more, but there's going to be DLC, there's going to be other stuff. Who knows exactly. Um, and then from the round table hold, we have access to all of them. Every single Coliseum. Oh, and you can go on any location from here. That's pretty cool. So you don't have to have a preference unless you're like, I want to fight specifically in this atmosphere for this reason, yada, yada. Um, I'm really looking forward to the United Combat with Allowed Summons 3v3s. That seems to be chaotic. And uh, we will probably get into that in another video once more people are playing online. Because I couldn't find anyone yet. But they are. those are the three Coliseums with a new update. Not even DLC. Um... And yeah, PvP is now even more crazy, and I can't wait to see builds and metas to, for the community to spring up again, since the game didn't exactly have a huge falling off, but this should pick it back up, especially after winning Game of the Year. Uh, hope to see you guys in the arena. Um, thank you very much, and we'll see you later.